Hey, good morning. <laughs> Happy Monday, everybody. I've got a few things going on this morning. You guys can go ahead and walk, walk around with me around my house while I get ready for the day. Uh, first, I'm going to go look into my humidor. And as you can see, it's so packed and I got so much stuff going on in here. But I want to go ahead and grab a cigar for the day. Let me see. I need to uh, figure out what I'm going to smoke today. Hmm, what do you guys think I should get? Good morning. I know it's pretty early. Hey, Stogie Rep. I am trying to find a cigar that I'm going to smoke for the day. Ooh, should I smoke this? Hmm. I think hmm, I'm going to say that. <laughs> I'm like, no, let's see what else I got in here. Oh, you know what? My father, yes, I think I'm gonna do that. Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, if you're just tuning in, I was uh, trying to find a cigar that I could smoke for the day. I think I found it. And it's the Lancero. I'm gonna flip this around so you guys can see me. This is my, my guest room <laughs> where I keep my humidor. I used to keep it in the garage, but the temperature would like go up and down and fluctuate and it was so annoying. Uh, but yep, so this is going to be my cigar for the day. And if you guys are just joining in, I got some packages. I am getting ready to go to work. As you can see, this is how I go to work. Um, I'm in advertising, if you guys didn't know. <laughs> and I've actually been making live videos for like seven years. And not those type of videos, guys. Calm down. <laughs> What's up? How are you guys doing? I see you tuning in. What's going on? So I got some packages that came in. I was uh, I was just preparing my uh, my cigar for the day. So I'm gonna go ahead and go with the uh, my father, Flor de las Santias, Lancero. Good stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and take it out the wrapper. Hey guys, good morning. You stay smoky as well. So I got some packages I wanted to share with you guys and. Um, let's see, what time is it? 7.59, okay. And then, um, also I think I'm gonna go ahead and make myself a coffee real quick. You guys wanna come with me? I figured I'd just like go live and you guys can like join me. I know it's pretty early, so probably not a lot of people are on right now. And if you are on, that's okay. <laughs> You're like me. You're straight onto Insta. Let's see what's up. Um, okay, so I'm gonna open up some packages. I was going to make myself a coffee really quick, and let's see. Do you guys want to see my coffee machine? Here we go. So let's see. I have a lot of vitamins. Which coffee mug should I go with? I like this one. Corojo and coffee. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and grab this one. All right. Go ahead and get this started but yeah I got I got a really big uh package in the mail so I'm excited to open that up with you guys and show you what I got um let's see here get my tea ready I'm actually gonna have tea a nice of coffee enjoy and have a good cigar thank you from Italy oh nice thank you so much all right okay so I've got my my father Flor de la Santia is going to be my cigar today. Once I finish work, I'll go ahead and throw it in my case. But in the meantime, <laughs> I'll hold on to it because I like to. Um, okay, let me grab my tea. Good morning, everybody. I'm just waiting to get a few more viewers. And then I'm going to start opening some boxes. This is one. And then I literally have a box that's so big, I probably can't even put it on the camera. Good morning. What's going on? Hope you guys had a great weekend. I'm about to open some boxes and um, it's pretty early. It's like 7.59, oh, 8 o'clock now. Um, I gotta go to work, but I was like, oh, I'm gonna let you guys experience a morning with me. And um, I just uh, picked my cigar for the day. So my father, Flor de las Antillas, the Lancero. I've not had the Lancero before. I do absolutely love the uh, Robusto. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this one. And I'm not a big Lancero fan, if you know me. 
I kind of like I'm more about like I want more tobacco than wrapper I guess um I like the filling you know but yeah so um okay I'm gonna grab my tea and we can go ahead and get started and oh look at this can you see that it's a little discolored that's always a good sign that means it's been aging I have been aging this one I kiss you. You kiss me. Oh my gosh. I missed that kiss though. <laughs> I didn't get the kiss. All right, guys. Okay, so you ready? So this is a box. Hey, I'm going to go ahead and sit down. This, this box is from a Barbecue and Smoke. I have absolutely no idea what is in this box. Um, they just, you know, had messaged me. and They're like, hey, we want to send you some stuff and check it out. So I'm excited to see what they said. So you guys ready? Let's, let's see what's in here. And uh, good morning from California. It looks like we are having a gloomy day. Of course, the day I decide to wear a dress. <laughs> so I'll probably be wearing some knee-high boots. I love knee-high boots. Good morning. Hi, 24 Carats. How are you? I met 24 Carats at a liquor store when I was doing... It's, like, it's actually more like a craft beer store. It's really cool. I was doing a live video there and I met her. She's a very lovely lady, very beautiful. All right. Oop. <laughs> okay, let's see what we got going on. Okay. The cleaning lady's coming today. She can clean all this. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's go ahead and take this out. Ooh. Can you guys see that? I wonder if there's cigars in here. <laughs> Good morning. All right, let's see what's going on. So first, it comes with a, does anybody know what this is? I was gonna say it's an apron. It is, oh, check this out. Hold on. It's an apron, how cute is this? Okay, that's cute. So it's an apron, and it has a place to put your, your drink. So it's got a drink holder. It's got a glove. Oh, yeah, that's so cute. A little towel. How fun is that? Barbecue and smoke. I love that. And then you got places where you keep your cigars and your cutter and everything. Oh, yeah, that's so cute. What do you guys think? Should I just wear this to work? <laughs> Good morning, hey guys, and go ahead if you want to uh, ask me any questions or anything, but that's cute, I love that. So, I got an apron in there. All right, let's see what's next. I totally need to dye my hair. It's all like growing out. <laughs> I know you guys don't, I know you guys don't care about that. 24 care of my <laughs> Okay. All right, there's a box. Let's see, I'm gonna get this out. And there's more. So you guys see barbecue and smoke. Why are you up so early? Because I have a meeting with you. <laughs> if not, I would be at the gym. I'd be at the gym, but I'm gonna go to Jim's office instead. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm getting ready. I'm gonna head to my office, and then I'm gonna head to your office, Jim. So I'll see you soon. Don't forget, 10 a.m. Um, okay, so barbecue and smoke. And let's see what we got in here. Okay, more of this stuff, yay. Hi, thank you for the hearts. I love hearts. I need one of those aprons. I know it's so cool, right? So, ooh, let's see what we got in here. So we got some goodies. Let's start off with, ooh, a barbecue sauce. Barbecue and smokes, pineapple barbecue sauce, yummy. I actually am huge into barbecuing, um, but the last time I barbecued, I accidentally turned on the back part of the barbecue. I don't know if you guys are like uh, very knowledgeable in barbecues, but that back part, I don't know what it's called, but I turned it on and it went and I just, ever since then, I kind of like been like semi like low key freaked out. <laughs> so yeah. Um, okay, so that's cool. Some barbecue sauce. What's up? Thank you for the hearts. And this is from, so if you guys are just tuning in, Barbecue and Smokes. 
Uh, they sent me a box. I got an apron so far, and now I'm checking some other stuff out. So this is a pineapple barbecue sauce. Ew, and I got a little flask. Oh, watch out. I like that, so cute little flask right there. Thank you. And there's more barbecue and smoke. Oh, they have their own seasoning. Ooh, it doesn't say anything on it, so I'm gonna have to figure out. Oh, wait, somebody said something that I can't. So I'm excited, guys. So make sure you stay tuned in because the next item two is like really big. And I can't wait to share it with everybody. I'm gonna open it for you guys. Hopefully it's all in one piece. I don't know, you never know. Uh, barbecue and smoke seasoning. Thank you. Then we've got, huh? Oh, watch out. So it has been really, really hot here. So um, these are chocolate covered blueberries. And I'm sure they probably would look a lot better if it wasn't for the traveling and the heat. But uh, they still look pretty good. They're like, a, they actually look like a blueberry, but it's chocolate covered blueberries. So cool, thank you. Hey guys, what's up? Hi, Mr. Lansbury, I see you. Jay, Muscle Car, what's up guys? I'm uh, unboxing a box from a barbecue and smoke. And so far I've got some cool little goodies for barbecuing and some chocolate. So here we got barbecue and smoke and let's see what's in here. The good stuff's in here. This is the good stuff, are you guys ready for the good stuff? Good morning, Mariella Soloro, Sol, Solorio, I think. <laughs> Christian, what's up? <gasps> Check it out. I got some cigars. All right, let's see. Let's see what we're working with. Lots of different sizes. The ring gauges on these are pretty huge. Check that out. Can you guys see that? This is Dewey's collection. Oh, DV's, DV's collection, there's that. Gosh, I really need another humidor. That's another one, that's Tres Lindas Cubanas Cigars. Nica Libra. Mm. Two different cigars in here, let's see. And of course, I was making sure they stay fresh. Short game, a short game. Yeah, I see that. That's actually that's a good name for it. Short, it's a couple short games. There we go. All right, all right. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, to smoke and uh, barbecue and smoke. This is so cute. I've been wanting one, and just look at it. it matches my nails, guys. Like how perfect is that? I love it. Love it. Look at I get very excited for the little things. Okay, I'm gonna tell you right now. That just made me so happy. Thank you so much. I love that. Oh, I've been wanting one of those. Thank you guys. Um, now there's more stuff. Let's see. Uh oh. I think this is a candle. Smoked patchouli. Yeah, I don't think I can open it. Oh, I think I opened it. I think it melted. Let's see. It's been, it was really, really hot. Today it's like raining. It's actually raining. I'll have to show you guys. Oh, <laughs> my candle melted. It's okay. <laughs> so uh, is this a cigar club? If so, what's the website? Well, you know, um, I, I believe it's like a barbecue and smoke club. Uh, so just go find them on, on uh, Instagram, barbecue and smoke established in 2020. I think a lot of things got established in 2020 because of the, the pandemic. But check this out. So that's a candle that melted. So I'm going to try to like fix it. I think there's some different ways to fix that. All right. There's more stuff. Is it? Oh, this is. Uh, this isn't stuff. This is just to keep everything fresh. All right. So that is my uh, barbecue and smoke box. Cool. Thanks, guys. That's awesome. Got a bunch of cigars. I'm going to need to put these in my humidor. And then, but there's more. So don't go yet. Hold on. Let me uh, just get everything cleaned up. See, I have a, I have a humidor back here. Shout out to uh, Tommy Sevilla. He uh, took care of me. I was running out of space. There it was in there. So I got that. Um, 
barbecue sauce, seasoning, glass, chocolate cup covered blueberries. Oh my gosh, my pick. I love it. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. I love I love things like that. <laughs> okay. Uh, candle that melted. <laughs> What's up? Hey, Chris. Good morning. How does it smell? Oh, that's a good question. It was melted inside. I didn't even think about that. It smells spicy. It's it smells it smells kind of like. Oh my God, that smells like. I don't know. It's spicy. It has a spice. Like there's a spice to that. Okay. So very cool. Thank you guys at Barbecue and Smoke. So you guys can check them out on Instagram. Barbecue and Smoke. I'll tag them in this video once I'm done. And uh, you guys can go ahead and and follow them. And follow them and check out what they have to offer. Just clean up a little bit here so I can make room for the next box. Are you guys ready? So the next box. We're going to read the, the outside of the box first. By the way, if you're just tuning in, this is going to be a cigar smoke today. Day, the uh, my father, Flor de las Santias, and it is the Lancero. And if you know me, I'm not a big Lancero fan. I will smoke a Lancero, but I'm still also trying to find that Lancero that that wows me. Kind of sounds like my love life. <laughs> Looking for my Lancero that's gonna wow me. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> okay. So, let me get this out of the way. Are you guys ready for the next big box? I'm gonna move all this stuff over here. And, okay, move this over here. Okay, so, oh yeah, and this is the apron. Did you guys, did you guys see the apron? It's so cute. It has a place to put your drinks. Like, you'd be barbecuing and like drinking a, a beer or a whiskey or whatever, whatever your drink of choice is. And there's, it's everything, it's so cute. Okay. Now it is time for the ultimate big box. Let me see if I can. Uh, somebody is trying to get on my live. Sorry, guys. If I don't know you, I do not let you get on my lives for one reason. Um, I like to keep my lives rated PG-13. <laughs> no, no X-rated over here. <laughs> All right, okay, so this is, well, this is my next box. This is huge. Let me see if I can, I do work out. There it is. Can you guys see that? Does anybody know what this is? Marhaba, what's up, Bakersfield gentlemen? Good morning. <laughs> so this is, <laughs> my next box and it, like I said it's a very big box and uh, let's go ahead I'm gonna start opening it I love to open it with you guys this is kind of probably like the biggest box I'm ever opening on a live but why the hell not right am I doing this right somebody's probably like Jessica stop you're gonna hurt yourself that's usually what happens I get like text messages later, like, Jessica, what'd you do? You didn't do that right. Whenever I do live videos. So you guys know, I actually have been making live videos for seven years for businesses, um, promoting like restaurants and stuff like that. So I've, I'm very, uh, very like connected with the, the live. As soon as the live button goes on, I'm like, ooh, live. So anyways, good morning, everyone. How do you get your teeth so white with smoking? Okay, it is not easy. It takes a lot of effort and don't cut yourself. I don't want to bleed in my office. I won't, I don't know, I'm gonna be careful. Hey, you saved my life. If not, I'd be using knives and scissors. And I, like you, you've seen in my last videos, I almost cut myself every time. <laughs> Um, but yes, so if you guys, you know, everybody always asks me that about like whitening your teeth. So it's, it's a lot of work. Honestly, it's really a lot of work. And there's a few different products that I use to keep my teeth white. Um, I, I'm going to do a video about that. So I'll keep you guys posted. I'll like show you guys everything that I use. Um, also, you know, everybody has like their, their feel on like how to keep your teeth white. 
um, or just like, you know, cause smoking, obviously smoking, it's gonna mess up your teeth, right? So you gotta do some stuff, but I'll keep you guys posted. I'll make a video for you guys telling you about everything I use. And uh, yeah, Sam, no worries. Yoder, Yoder smokers. So, all right, what are you guys doing out there while I, while I finish opening this? So look at this. I don't know if you guys can see. You guys, I'm gonna take you off the, off here so you can see a little bit better. Okay, ready for this? All right, so it is the New Air 250 count thermo thermoelectric cigar humidor with heating. All right, so features a digital thermostat with heater and cooler function, adjustable Spanish cedar drawer and shelves. Somebody's gonna be seasoning their humidor today. Uh, what is it? Internal internal fan force circulation for even humidity. Digital hygrometer with triple pane glass door. Lock and key to protect your collection. Awesome. So I just got that in the mail. I'm going to um, go ahead and open this up so I can show you guys. And then I've got to get to work. Actually, I'm going to okay, I'm gonna put this on the ground. So you guys are going to have to like kind of wait for me for a second. But um, I have to, the person I have to go meet with is actually watching the live right now. Hey, Jim. <laughs> then I'm going to run to my office first. I gotta go to my office, print out some stuff. And then I'll be heading out to meetings. I got so many meetings today. What do you guys got going on today? Hi, hi, Burn. Uh, hi, Gandhi. Uh, Oh, they work awesome. So Chris uh, is uh, endorsing my new humidor and you said they work great. So that's awesome. I'm excited. Oh, let me see. Does anybody want to come help me real quick? No. I can do this. No. Okay. Hold on. I'll be right back. <laughs> Just tuning in. I'm opening up my second box of the day. Shit. This box is a little bit bigger. So I gotta love lives. You never know what's gonna happen. Okay. Yeah, I needed help. Where were you? And I needed my help. <laughs> okay. So uh, let's see. Let's open this up and check it out. Are you guys ready? So this is from New Air. I'm going to try to get this back a little bit so you guys can see. Here it is. Ooh, look at that. So if you are newer to cigars um, and you only have the tabletop, humidor right now. I highly recommend getting one of these. As you can see, you can, uh, you know, keep, keep your cigars at the perfect temperature. And, uh, you know, if not, it's, it is a little bit harder to keep them in a tabletop. That means you have to keep your whole house, you know, at a certain temperature. So I love this because I know I can put my cigars in there and um, there's different systems to help you keep track of it. So like I use the Boveda Butler, I have them in my humidors. And so it actually like, and which they discontinued them. So do not look up Boveda Butlers. I literally like was on a, a hunt to find them because I already have one and I was like, well, I want a second one. 
and um, but it helps you make sure that your humidor is always at the right temperature and always at the right humidity and then it sends you notifications if it's not so it's pretty pretty neat hey what's up oh you're too far to help oh, it's okay thank you guys thank you what's up thanks for the hearts um but check this out look at that isn't that beautiful let's open it up so uh maybe later today i'll make some like videos like showing because you know i know there's a lot of uh seasoned smokers out there but there's also a lot of newbies and people that like aren't very familiar with with what this is what a cigar like or how to take care of your cigars so I'm actually learning. I'm going to I'm going to uh, Tobacconist University right now to just like learn more and understand it better. Um, just because I've gotten so involved in cigars and I and I um, I've been visiting a lot of lounges. So I'm like, you know what? Let me. I'm I'm always that. Let me take it to the next level type of person. And so I'm taking it to the next level. But uh, yeah, check this out. So from New Air Humidor, 250 count humidor very nice i love it i can't wait to start using it get rid of um not get rid of but like you know not i i want it i like i love my tabletop however i love this a little bit more <laughs> Alrighty, guys so that is my unboxing for this monday i hope you enjoyed and uh if you guys are looking for a humidor uh, Chris himself said that it was a uh, it's a great humidor, but that's a uh, new air and this one let me see, What's it called again the new air? This is Rocco say hi Rocco Say hi to everybody <laughs> New air 2050 count thermoelectric cigar humidor with heating I'll make sure to tag them so you can follow their page as well as uh, their websites I'll go ahead and add it to my bio, but you guys are amazing okay so you want to say it with me we are amazing <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and go put this in my travel case i'm gonna get ready i'm gonna go to work i'm gonna have an amazing day so you so are you guys and uh yeah i'm jessica q also known as stogie chick i'll see you guys later bye <laughs>